Look at that. Big new change. I'm still getting used to the casino. That's a big spot on the map. <laughs> Let's pull up out front. Much better than the old pull up. Mm, much better. Hey, no valet? No, nobody. Oh, that one guy. Hmm, kind of lonely. <laughs> no valet parking today. Hello there, everybody. We're back. I'm back. I'm Lewis and Zach. Welcome back for more Grand Theft Auto Online news. Yeah, so we're going to get to the news wire in a second and uh, get to where I've been. I've been kind of gone for a few weeks there. So uh, we'll deal with that when we come right back. Talk about all that. <laughs> in the meantime, I guess I'll head in. So you guys can have a look at that news wire, find out about the double money, and we'll come right back. A new card this week, too. Another one. See you guys in a minute. All right, everyone. So here's the latest Rockstar Games Newswire. Impressionable and talentless idiots on a mission to entertain. <laughs> That's Rockstar. So this is the latest uh, Rockstar Newswire for today, August 29th, until September 4th. The Ocelot Locust Sports Car, plus double bonuses on gun running and cargo sales, free libraries, and more. Uh, right now, I've been gone for the last little uh, little while, maybe a month almost. And, um, and I don't think they really had a lot of good deals on the go, so I think uh, a lot of people are really happy to see this. Gun running and cargo sales and some other stuff showing up, so let's have a look. Another new car, presenting the all-new Ocelot Locust. Now available at Legendary Motorsport. I think that's actually a returning car from uh, GTA Online uh, London, or London... GTA 1969, London, something like that. The open dot two-seater Locust pedigree goes all the way back to 69. Hell yeah. And this is what you get after decades of track testing. No roof, no windscreen, no windows, no compromises, and no interest in personal safety. If you ever wondered what it's like to drive around a logical conclusion, this is your chance to find out. The Ocelot Locust Sports Car. Now available at Legendary Motorsport. <laughs> and that's available for uh, $1,625,000. All right, gun running bonuses. Take it to your take to your hidden underground bunker or nightclub warehouse to make some extra GTA money this week with all gun running sale cell missions paying double cash through September 4th. Gun running research is also being carried out at two times speed for the same period, so be sure to thank your staff on the way out. So if you have any gun running research you want to do um, in your new bunker or any new players, you might want to do that this week. That's double speed. And gun running cell missions, not says or nightclub warehouse there too. It doesn't quite specifically say warehouse cell missions, but it implies it is because it says nightclub warehouse there. So yay. So that seems to imply double gun running and double nightclub. Yeah. Cargo sale bonuses. Various types of contraband are in high demand. Run crates from your hangar or special cargo warehouse to reap double journey GTA money on special cargo sales and smuggler cargo sales. So that would be all the smugglers run cargo sales from your, uh, from your um, uh, hangar, your aircraft hangar. If you wanted to run any of those or get rid of the ones you had, maybe you could built up some for your uh, discounts for the uh, aircraft. It's a good, uh, good week to get rid of them. And of course, the big one, special cargo sales. So that's the uh, large crate warehouses and things like that. You can make instead of the normal 2.2 million, you can make all the way up to 4.4 million each warehouse. So that's pretty good. Takes a little while to fill them up though. Bunker series bonuses. Head towards the Bunker Series Corona on your map or launch any Bunker Missile Base Adversary mode via the in-game menu. Turn double GTA money and RP on the Bunker Series, which includes fan favorite subterranean skirmishes like Juggernaut, Every Bullet Counts, and more. So there's something extra for other people to do against other people too, for double money. And unlock this week the Ocelot T. There it is, the Ocelot T. Not sure if we had an Ocelot T already, but now we got a new one. Looks good. It's end September 4th. When you hand over your key, hand your keys to the valet, you might start to miss the purr of an ocelot beneath your loins. Let everyone know what kind of ride you've got in the garage with complimentary ocelot tea awarded to all GTA Online players this week. It's a Sunday Nove library, libraries. The gratis, the gratis perks don't end there. Play GTA Online anytime this week through September 4th to get the Sasante Novo monogram and the Sasante Nove multicolored libraries for the HVY Barrage, HVY HP, APC, and the Pegasi Oppressor, all free of charge. Hmm. New podium vehicle, Chevelle Type N. That's always good to have more libraries, and it's not even better when they're free, too. And the new podium vehicle for the week, take a free spin at the Lucky Wheel. You can spin that once per in-game day, or in-game day, per uh, real-life day, I should say. So once every 24 hours, which I think they should change. I think they should change that to every 12 hours. That's a little excessive. 
uh, you know, of a wait. If you stayed in game, and hopefully none of you guys would stay in game for 24 hours, that's not a good idea. But if you did stay in game for 24 hours, that would be 28 days roughly um, for the in-game time. So that'd be 28 sunrises, 28 sunsets, 28 bills, you know, and to me that's a long time to wait for your next spin, 28 days for the in-game time. So I think they should lower that to, lower that to 12 uh, real life hours instead of uh, 24. Yeah, but either way, you can win a Cheval Taipan before September 4th. Stop by the lobby of the Diamond Casino and Resort to, to give the lucky wheel its free daily spin for the opportunity to score GTA money and RP and clothing and more. This week's top prize is the Cheval Taipan Supercar, and it's all in its clinical, algorithmically designed glory. <laughs> the Casino Store. The Casino Store at the Diamond includes the return of fan-favorite clothing and accessories like the gold roulette Kronos Tempo timepiece, as well as classic works of uh, art to adorn your penthouse like Billy Wiener's Le Chien and Joe Killam's National Fabric. Hmm. Discounts. Dell players get a leg up on the trading front. Maze Bank Foreclosures is offering discounts on all bunkers and hangars and their respective renovations and add-ons, as well as premium vehicles like the Coil, Coil Cyclone, Entity XSR, and more. This week, take 40% off. Hmm. Pardon me, little coffee. Will help. All right, bunkers. So 40% off bunkers and bunker renovations and add-ons. So if you want to change any of those or add on anything or maybe add on the target range, um, you know, it's kind of one of those add-ons that not everybody has, not everybody wants, but 40% off is a good week to get that. And you, if you do complete the target ranges up to, to silver level, only silver, you don't even have to go to gold, um, you get five uh, extra permanent throwables. So permanently you can carry more grenades, more uh, five extra uh, sticky bombs, all those kinds of things. Hangers in the hangar workshop, so if you need one, it's a good time to get that. And that also gives you cargo for your nightclub. If you don't have uh, special crate warehouses, you can always just have a hangar, and your nightclub can source from the cargo from that as well. So some people don't know, you could just get a hangar, and then you don't need the crate warehouses for your nightclub, for those that just do the nightclub sourcing. Hangar workshop and the hangar renovations and add-ons, which is good. The hangar workshop is very expensive to be able to modify them. It's over a million dollars, so that's good to have that off. V65 Molotov, the Mammoth Thruster, the HVY Barrage, the HVY APC, and the Overflood Entity XXR Supercar, Coil Cyclone Supercar, and the Ocelot Lynx Sports Car, all 40% off. Twitch Prime discounts. Twitch Prime members who link their Twitch and Rockstar Games social club accounts before August 26th will receive 75% off the Akula and the HVY Menacer. Both good deals. The Akula is very good. Plus an additional 10% off all the above listed discounts. Visit Twitch Prime to sign up and ensure your access to next week's benefits. All right, so let's head over to the, uh, to the social club events and have a look at those. See what these weeks this week's is. R. <laughs> this week's R. All right, so all the stuff we covered in there. And the premium race is uh, business trip locked to supercars. And the RC time trial is Hill Valley Church Cemetery, and the regular time trial is Sawmill. And as we've said before, the first time you complete the time the time trials, you get a bonus, which has been raised by Rockstar recently to a hundred thousand now for the first time you complete them. So it's a good little distraction to do those. All right. Now, just recapping, because I was gone for a little while, um, just some of the cars they've also brought out in the last month for those that uh, follow the news and didn't didn't pay attention in game, I guess. But they also have the Volker Nebula Turbo, which is uh, kind of sort of a Volvo first generation 242 GT. Yeah, and uh, that came out just recently for 797. I believe, yeah, 797,000. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And the uh, the progen progen Emirates, which is uh, two million seven hundred fifty thousand, yeah, very expensive. So that's actually the most expensive new car actually, in the game. So I think before that, and this, we're talking about cars that don't have weapons or rockets or things like that. So just to clarify, we have the regular cars. This is the new most expensive car at two point seven million and fifty thousand. Before that, the uh, Grady X eighty, uh, yeah, Grady X eighty was the 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 old uh, most expensive regular car. And it was a two million seven hundred thousand, so just fifty thousand less. They also brought us out the um, uh, the uh, uh, it says right here the Prado got in the classic. <laughs> yeah, and that one didn't have a bad price either, six hundred fifty thousand. A lot of people really like that car. Great customization. It doesn't necessarily have a high top speed, but a lot of the cars from that era didn't. So they were kind of made made for going fast down the uh, drag race, of, in a sense, or down between friends down a drag race down a road, but not necessarily about top speed. But still a great car for those who like those kinds. Yep, another muscle car. And the Pfizer Neato, which is actually a new company, so this is a Dutch automotive, the brand first car from Pfizer. Yeah. And the Pfizer Neo is uh, 1875000 And that's all the new cars, and now we're all up to date. One new one today, the Locust. 
Yeah, so far it's been dusted as being middle of the pack. For those that are wondering, it's a sports car, and uh, it's roughly in the uh, in the twentieth place, depending on lap time or uh, top speeds. So you know, I think it's twenty third in, in uh, lap time. No, in uh, in top speeds and twenty eighth in in top speed or in lap time. <laughs> That's confusing. I'll try that again. The twenty third in top speed and twenty eighth in lap time. So that may not sound very very good, but there is I think around sixty sports cars in the game somewhere around there. So it's the middle of the pack. But I wouldn't say to get it. It seems to be like the Ocelot Pariah is still the best one to go for the sports cars in the racing classes. All right, let's head back in game. A new luxury car is available to win. Stop by and have a try at the Lucky Wheel. Hmm. All right. All right, everybody. So, uh, much better newswire than recently, although they've been giving us lots of new cars, but a lot of people have been kind of disappointed with the ways to make money. Yeah, so we're going to come out with our casino DLC. I've got to get my master suite. I'm going to do that, I think, right away. Um, get these two videos going at the same time. This news you're watching now and that episode. So, yeah. And it's a good week to win yourself a Chevelle type band back there. I do like the new wheel. I think that's a great idea. I've got a couple friends who already uh, won the last week's car. Yeah, very cool. One thing, like I said before in the Newswire, I think it should really be cut in half that time. 12 hours, maybe 16, maybe 8, I don't know. But I think that's too too, uh, too long, 24 hours. If you're one of those people that works early in the morning, Monday to Friday or something like that, you know, you could be up late on a Sunday and spin the wheel, and you'd probably miss Monday because you were up late. You wouldn't be able to play it again until late Monday, and usually most people would be in bed by then. As an example of some of the ways it can mess with you, it'd be in a solid 24 hours. It's too bad. It should be a little bit shorter, I think. <laughs> all right everybody well uh, and where was i yes uh, i was gone i was gone i didn't mean to be gone that went long i went to a uh, friend's um, a dear friend's uh, wedding and it was an excellent wedding excellent wedding and unfortunately i got ill afterwards i actually had to take some antibiotics and stuff it was a bad bug um and specifically i couldn't talk it was a bad throat bug like i was uh, um, felt like a really bad sore throat i guess but uh, but it was different but yeah it was not pleasant at all i was caught and cold all the time and all that kind of stuff so that took a good week to get over and get my voice back. And, uh, and right afterwards, um, I had uh, a system. You know, of course, it didn't happen while I was ill. But as soon as I uh, was ready, my system kind of gave me a bunch of issues. So I had a bunch of equipment failures and things I had to fix. A bunch of boring things to tell you about, but a bunch of uh, um, tech detective stuff. <laughs> I had to follow all kinds of long shot things to get to the bottom of get, get my computer going for you guys. So, so here we are back again. Yeah. A lot more than that, but nothing very exciting. But it was just kind of one of those train of things. I guess they say uh, all these things happen in threes sometimes. Bad things happen in threes. So hopefully I'm done with all that. But uh, the unfortunate part was it happened one after the other. So made my gap a little bit longer than I wanted. Good news is we got lots of new cars to check out and a new property to check out. And uh, yeah, ongoing stuff everywhere. Yep. <laughs> you can hear all the games over there. It's awesome. Yep. All right, everybody. Well, that's pretty cool news wire. Um, don't forget to do your lucky spin on the wheel, at least every 24 hours anyway. And I'll see you guys back here for the next regular episode this time, definitely. <laughs> at least, well, knock on wood, because you never know. Hopefully the equipment will continue, <laughs> and I'll get it all done. Yeah, and I do like the, uh, the, the suite now that I've looked up some more information about it. It does seem like a decent deal. You know, just some extra information that I'm going to cover again in my episode. But some people, some players don't really know that uh, the first time you complete the missions um, for this for this property, for the uh, upstairs property, the suite, uh, the Pento suite, um, it has six missions, six storyline missions. So that's kind of cool, new storyline. But a lot of players don't know that the first time you complete it, you get an extra 50000 for each mission. So up to for those first six, but you don't get the, that money until you go back into free mode. So a lot of people never noticed the money showing up or wondered why they got extra money when they were later on in free mode. And that was why. Now that you get extra money too, if you're hosting. So if you host those, um, those missions, those six missions, you get a hundred thousand, I believe it is for each one. So I think it works out too. A lot of people say 500,000, but it should be 600,000. But, uh, but uh, they give you that reward again when you go back to free mode. So a lot of people don't notice until afterwards. It doesn't show up in your pay. It just shows up like a bonus in free mode. Oh, the guys having a look around. <laughs> yeah. So just a little bit of extra information that not everybody knows about. And uh, yeah, hopefully I'll help you guys make some more money. So you do want to join up in those missions and you do want to uh, host those missions separately at some point in time anyway too. 
All right, everybody. Well, that's this week's news. Hopefully one of many more to come. And I'm going to get going on that other episode on the, uh, the new property. Maybe some new cars to follow that, too. And some new grinding episodes, too. Maybe some casino games, too. <laughs> Take care, everybody. I'm going to head out and get the truck. Yeah, believe it or not, I haven't even been a, uh, I haven't even uh, become a member yet. I still have to press Q for that. <laughs> so I've been waiting for you guys for everything. It's been hard. Here and there I could get on, you know, just to make sure things were working right when I was testing things. And it was so tempting to spin the wheel, but I didn't want to spin it without you guys. And money-wise, we're okay, you know, so I didn't really have to worry about that. So, so I waited. I still, I wanted to spin the wheel like my friends. <laughs> so we'll get that gun, and I'll see you guys back here for that. Take care, everybody. See you soon. back so I can get a better car for the casino this is just not not a good car to get uh, to get the good treatment at the casino right <laughs> not the VIP treatment when you show up in a work van <laughs> I'm wondering what car to put in my garage first in my uh, penthouse garage my new penthouse suite garage yeah so I'll have to go decide that so I'll see you guys back here soon Upstairs, tell Connie I said hey. Don't make a big team though. Just say hey from me. Hey. <laughs> Bye. Come visit us sometime. <laughs> All right, everybody. So I'm just at the nightclub warehouse here, and uh, we watched. We read in the newswire that it said, "Or your nightclub warehouse." If you remember that part, the little strange part there. Um, so I just thought I'd check in here, but nothing seems to be double money. I'm not really sure what's going on, but everything, I don't know, unless I'm adding it up wrong, um, it seems to be the same as usual. So I don't know what they meant by that. Maybe there's double speed on the sourcing. I don't know. I'd have to watch it longer for that. Maybe there's double, maybe there's extra speeds on the, uh, um, better speeds or on the money upstairs in the nightclub, but they specifically mentioned the nightclub warehouse. So... Uh, but I don't really see any differences in the money being made here, at least for now. So I'm not sure if that was a typo or if uh, a bug that they didn't give it to us. Or if there's something else I'm missing, and may, or may, like I said about the research, maybe they meant double uh, uh, sourcing speed or something like that. So I just thought I'd throw that in there, guys, because I was a little confused about it when I read it and uh, still confused about it. Now I'm checking on it. <laughs> Take care, everybody. See you, see you next time.